Hi, this is Victor Wong. I'm the CEO of Music Computing, and I'm sitting next to the new Modulus console. And a Modulus is a combination of touchscreens and other controllers that we put together to create a system that's going to give you better control over your DAW than anything else out there. And the reason being is that touchscreens allow you to visually see exactly what your software interface is, and the touch surfaces allow you to instantly touch and grab and control anything on that screen. Uh, something that's really convenient if you're switching from one DAW to another or you're using different plugins and you haven't mapped those to physical controllers. And uh, it works with everything out there. Um, even though we won't be showing all the different DAWs, um, it works with Logic, it works with Pro Tools, and it's very, very versatile and very quick. In this video, we've selected two to show you what are some of the things you can do with it and some of the limitations currently uh, based on what the software can or can't do but that Modulus makes up for in its control capabilities. So um, here we go, and uh, thanks for uh, tuning in again. All right, first up we have Presonus Studio One Pro. As you can see, it's very easy to hit the transport buttons on the touchscreen, as well as selecting a track to adjust the volume using the motorized fader. Scrolling on the bottom allows you to see all your different tracks. Then you can select each one and change the volume as you need. You can simply drag and drop effects into your master channels. And then open up the various interfaces for the plugins. And be able to affect them by touching the touch screen. In certain situations where fine tuning is necessary, we recommend the use of a trackball. However, most of the time for macro movements, the touchscreen is perfectly fine. Changing from mix to edit to different windows is simple. The next DAW we're going to show you is Sonar from Cakewalk. It's new and it has multi-touch capabilities built into it. As you can see, the zoom in and out, both horizontally and vertically, works very well and is very smooth. In addition, you can grab multiple faders and move them at the same time. Unfortunately, the faders tend to jump when you stop. This happens very often in this particular software. In addition, you cannot finger tap to select the channels. You have to use a trackball or a mouse. But once you've done that, you can use the motorized fader to properly adjust the levels in a very smooth manner. Pushing solo and mute buttons are easy. And you can simply select effects and have them inserted into each channel and call the interface to control the VST. In this particular VST, the knobs are very smooth and do not need a trackbar or mouse for fine movement. So there you have it. That's what Modulus is all about. The ability to control your DAW when you want to and how you want to instantly. For more information about Modulus and all the various options, please go to www.musiccomputing.com. Thank you. Ain't nothing free. And nickels and dimes won't get you very far with me. But that's the only currency that I receive. So back to reality, I just got to be me.